Hi, hi everyone, and welcome to Positively Kimmy. I am Kimmy. Um, what I'm doing is 30 days of palette reviews, seeing what I like, what I don't like, what I grab for, what I don't grab for, and trying to declutter what I don't need, and then shop my stash, because I have a lot of really great palettes. Uh, the one I'm going to be doing today is the Holo Charmer by Boxy Charm. The colors in here are beautiful. Obviously, I've used them before, but I haven't reached for it in a really long time, and I'm wondering if there was a reason for that or if it's just that it's not one of my go-to ones. So we're going to do a really simple look tonight with this. Probably only going to go into two or three colors. I'm going to use this. I want to use this as a topper and maybe this to darken it out. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a fluffy brush. This is my Luxie. And I'm going to use the unboxing, which is the red one right here. Okay. Okay. Look at that. Do you see that? Do you see all that fallout? I don't like fallout. And I'm going to put this directly in my crease. And I'm probably going to put it all over my lid. We might only use one or two colors today. Um, because you don't always have to do a huge look. You can always darken it, lighten it, whatever you want to do. It's not very pigmented. I, I keep going into my pan and it doesn't seem to be pigmented like that. But I just, I think we're only going to go do two colors, maybe possibly three. And I'm going to try and like put as much pigment as I can in the crease to darken it. And just bun that. And make the inside a little bit lighter. And see what happens. So I hope you all are having a good day. Uh, don't forget, we're trying to get to 50 subscribers and then we'll do a giveaway. I have a lot of things set aside so, so far for my giveaway. And I can't wait to do that. So if you could like and su subscribe and share maybe the, um, you know, send this to people so they can like and subscribe and we'll get to 50 and you will get something nice. At least somebody will. Um, I'll do the generator thing and see what happens and, you know, we'll, we'll uh, do that. So today I am having a really good day, sort of, <laughs> but we're going to pretend it's a really good day. It is a good day. Every day above ground is a good day, my dad used to say. Um, and what, you know, um, I did a whole bunch of positive affirmations. Now, when I first started my affirmations, I thought it was a bunch of malarkey, to put it lightly. Okay. See, so we put a lot in our crease and it looks like we have a lighter color. Um, on the lid and we really don't now what you can do is I think I'm going to go into a cup of gel which is this one right here and just darken my my V right here and I have a lot of fallout from this and we're just going to darken that because that's the darkest matte shade we have in here I just want to darken that a little bit you know you don't always have to go so wild with your eyeshadow. So anyway, when I first started doing positive affirmations, I told you guys I couldn't come up with anything that I, I thought I was. Um, I thought I wasn't, not a bad person because I'm really not, but I didn't think I had any, you see that fallout? Redeeming qualities, like I didn't know why people would want to talk to me. And um, it turns out I'm not as bad as I thought I was. And I have a lot of really good qualities and now I can come up with a whole bunch of them and I had four pages, and I am so proud of the fact that not only do I have four pages of affirmations, but I believe exactly what every one of those things says, because that says a lot about how far I've come. I'm going to take a clean brush that we use for our fallout here, and we're going to go like that. And now we're just going to use our finger, and we're going to go to swipe up right here and put that on, because that's a topper shade. It's got, like, chunky glitter, and we're going to do that. And I think that's going to be our look for today. And still not sure how I feel about the palette as I'm doing this. Because the fallout, I know a lot of people don't mind fallout. It depends. It depends on my mood and stuff like that. So we'll see. And that is a gorgeous, gorgeous shimmer shade. And I've just hit pan on it. See, and we don't need to do too much. What I'm going to do is use an eyeliner. If you saw my video earlier, I used the Vortex. I think that's what it's called. 
um, eyeliner guide and it worked out perfectly. So let me get my black eyeliner and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have my black eyeliner. It's from She Glam and I love it. It is got the finest tip. So what you do is you're gonna use this as your guide. And I don't have a mirror here, so. Look at that. And that just gives you your guide as to where you're gonna do it. And look at that. And then we're gonna take this, and this is without me looking in a mirror, and I'm just looking in my viewfinder. And we're gonna go like that and I'm going to do the same thing over here and look at that I'm going to connect that and I'm going to connect that and it's just amazing I think this is the most amazing thing it's all about placement oops use my guide look at that and it comes out perfect so this is the look for tonight we're just doing some shimmer some wetness some shade we have a light color the same color on our lid that we do on our crease and we use our vortex eyeliner and I think it came out beautiful I'm going to just fix my inner corner because I don't like that looking like that. I think it looks better like that. And now that we see this up close, we can see where we missed a few spots. And we're just filling that in. There we go. So let me know what you guys think. If you're gonna pick up the Vortex liner, I got it on Amazon. And it was $7. It was very, very cheap. The She Glam um, eyeliner is amazing. And this is a BoxyCharm palette. And even though I don't reach for it, there are some colors I really, really enjoy in it. And I think I'm going to keep it. So this is a number 12. 11 or 12? I think it's 12. And we're not going to declutter this one. We're going to keep this one a little bit longer. You guys, stay thankful. Stay grateful. Stay blessed and make sure you stay positively you. Bye.